Welcome to another video, a walk on the wild side, and I am here in Blackpool. I'm actually up north in this video, yeah, a little bit out of my comfort zone, yeah, not that familiar with this part of Blackpool. I'm actually in Bispam, and just behind me here is the magnificent Bispam Branch Library. What an amazing building, let's check it out, shall we? Look at this here, we've got a bit of a green space here surrounding the library yeah they seem to have a bit more greenery going on this part of blackpool than they do in the central part look at this yeah and we'll take a little look at the library so we're in the bispam village area i'll take you around and we'll have a little look at a minute but i want to check out the library first just look at this building here yeah that's got to be 1930s hasn't it and i reckon this was designed by the architect, the council architect, J.C. Robinson. It's one of his many designs. In Blackpool, he designed quite a few public buildings. He also designed Middle Walk. Yeah, look at this. I don't know if it's a library, actually. Can anyone tell me if this is still a library? Or is it a community hub? I don't know. I take it that these doors here, I might be wrong, um, but you don't go in this way anymore uh, they do have a disabled access here but i don't know does that gate open no I d no that gate's stuck there so this was the main entrance but i take it it can't be now yeah so i think the main entrance is round here so we'll have a little look round shall we we'll have a little bit of a nosy it looks like the hedge has been cut look at that there the privet hedge has been cut all round look at that so they've got quite a bit of garden there it is now this looks to me like this is where you go in and it's got up there the new langdale at bispam so uh this must be the main entrance look at this there uh, you're required to wear a face covering in this building that must be a bit of an old sign mustn't it <laughs> oh my goodness don't remind me about that <sighs> yeah so that's i've never been in here by the way so this must be the entrance. And is it a community hub? I take it it's a community hub, you know. And that's what they do with libraries now, isn't it? The, the regional library sort of thing, you know, the smaller ones. And just there we've got a garden out the back of it. Look, look at this. That's quite fancy, isn't it? I wonder if they've got a cafe in there as well. Yeah, so I'm quite a long way from home in this video because I live in the southern part of Blackpool so I'm not really used to being up this end but it's quite a nice part of Blackpool Bispam and it borders if you carry on up that way up Devonshire Road the main road you get into Cleveland so we're kind of on the border with Cleveland up this oh, oh it is quite a long way that way you know Blackpool is actually quite big when you think of if you look at it on a map if you look at the promenade all the way from Stargate right up to the border with Cleveland, which is where Anchor's Home Park is. You'll see it must be about seven miles long. It really is a, a pretty big place. But uh, this is Little Bispam where I am now, and I thought we'd just have a little look around here for a change. So we'll leave the Bispam Branch Library behind. That's what it used to be called. Still got the sign on the front, of course. And uh, we'll head out here onto Devonshire Road. Look at this here, look, grass verges, trees, tree lines. This is a major road that links the north end of Blackpool, eventually linking up almost with Cleveland. Not quite, but almost. And it's pretty swanky, yes. This is pretty swanky, as you might imagine, because they've got these big grass verges, they've got big detached houses, trees. So I'm going to head up here to this roundabout, the roundabout with Red Bank Road. It is a major roundabout, very, very busy. So we'll have a little look round here. Uh, probably won't bump into any beer monsters around here because I don't think they have beer monsters up this end. At least I don't think they do anyway. <laughs> well, there's a bit of evidence of uh, some drinking going on around here. There's a, a smashed bottle there. I'm just going through this building here, which looks a bit like a, must be a bus shelter, mustn't it? 
it just links up with this park. There's the library over there, look at that. It's a grand building, isn't it? Gardens could do with being a little bit tidy, but I'm probably being a bit too fussy there. That's the problem, you see. Garden areas, landscaping, it always gets the money taken away and nothing ever looks the same as what it used to because you take all the money away from that and put it into other things. But it looks okay. Here's one last look. It's just good to have a bit of a green space, really, because there's not much of this in central Blackpool. So I've just come out onto this road on the other side now. This is called Bispen Road. Again, this links up with Blackpool, but it links up with Blackpool more sort of towards the northeast of town. And uh, just behind me is the, the roundabout, the major roundabout. And they've even got their own police station up there, yeah. <laughs> Bispam have got their own police station, although I think it serves here and it also serves Fleetwood, Poulton, that sort of, uh, those sort of places. So we'll go and check that out, shall we? So let's leg it over here and check out Bispam PD. Check out that hydrangea there. That looks pretty awesome, doesn't it? That's a lace cap, by the way. It's a lace cap hydrangea. And a buddleia there. No butterflies on it at the moment. They've probably all gone to bed. Because I'm filming this at about quarter past nine. Yes, in the evening. And here's a roundabout. It's like a double roundabout, yeah? It's a bit of a confusing one, I have to say. If you've never been on it before. But it is pretty busy, and look at this now. Check it out, Bispen Police. Look. I wonder what it's like around here. Does it kick off in Bispen like it can do in Blackpool? Well, I don't know. Never say never. But anyway, you see that road up there? That road straight up there, that's Red Bank Road. And that takes you all the way to the promenade and to where the illuminations come to an end or start, depending on which way around you go. But it's generally considered to be the end of the, the Blackpool illuminations. There's a, the roundabout there. They've got uh, fake grass in the middle of it, so they can't be bothered mowing the lawn. And we're coming down now to Bispen Village. Check it out. Look at this. Got a nice looking restaurant over there. Look at that there. Jasmine Oriental Fusion. Got a load of shops around here. Pizza Hut. Uh, what have we got here? Hairdressers. What's this place here? Bar and Grill. Not open at the moment, but uh, they've got some England flags up, so it, it might have been open fairly recently. I don't know. A bit of takeaway there, Cairo. They've got quite a few things here, you know, in Bispin Village. They've even got a Heron Foods here as well. You know, I've never been in Heron Foods. Bispin Village. I wouldn't say that it was. Uh, the most happening of places. Got a little precinct here where you can come in and park. We've got a bookmaker's there, Coral. Oh look, a vape shop. They're everywhere, aren't they? Now all we need is a Turkish barbers. Got a butcher's there. D La War Butchers, Sayers Bakery. I quite like Sayers, I think they're all right. Bargain booze, yeah. Hey, look at that, they've even got a senior. Seeing this chippy now, seeing these are quite big up here, and I think they're pretty good. I do. Seeing these fish and chips, they're uh, they're family run, and they have quite a lot of chippies in Blackpool. Well, down to Lytham as well, and up to Cleveley's. Seeing these, yeah, check it, check them out. If you if you get a chance to visit seeing these, do. But we're just taking a look around this uh, precinct here. What we got over here? It's proper 60s here, isn't it? It's a bit like being in Milton Keynes, this. It's a, we haven't got the grid pattern. We've got a charity shop over there, we've got Tesco Express. 
Check it out, Bisbon Market. It's not a market though, is it? It says Barbers, is that? Let's have a look at this. Uh, it says there, Bisbon Market. They don't look like a market to me. Oh, hang on a minute. It might be. Maybe if you go in there, what do you think? If anyone knows, let me know. Uh, the barbers there, it doesn't look like a Turkish barbers. So, oh, look down there. That looks swanky, doesn't it? Oh, there's a big pub over here called the Albion. I'll show you that in a minute. But uh, it's one of a nosy down there. It looks proper swank down here. Look at that. We've got a tree. We've got another parking lot around the back here. I'm not sure if this is a public park. I think it is actually. There's no there's no signs or anything. So we're getting a good look at Bisbon Village here. Seems pretty quiet, mind you, like I say. It's getting quite late now, the sun's gonna be going down any time now. Uh, but it does look like we're coming into like a residential area down here. It looks like quite swanky actually, you know, what do you think? Down there, those houses do look quite nice. So I'll just head back up this way and I'll show you the pub. So I'm just heading back up this way and we're now outside the pub called the Albion. And there's a sign there which kind of tells you where you can get to from the roundabout. Turn right to get to Cleveland and Fleetwood. Straight on takes you to Queen's Promenade, of course, up Red Bank Road. And if you go to the top left, you get to Blackpool Town. If you go down here, it takes you to the motorway. Check out this pub here. It's massive, isn't it? The Albion. Looks very impressive as well, doesn't it? Look at that there. I've been in there a couple of times as well. Yeah, it's pretty good. So this is the pub here in Bisbon Village. And they've even got the road sign on the side. Look at this. This is one of the old road signs there with like the tiles. You, you get the tiled letters and you slot them in there. So it's good to see an old road sign on there at the Albion pub here in Bisbon Village. Welcome to Bisbon Village car park. Short stay, yeah, so you can park here for what looks like up to four hours by the look of it, yeah. Check it out, free parking here in Bisbon. Now then, that's an armed response unit, that. Wow, it's got that uh, that star on the back, that orange star. Wow, is it kicking off in Bisbon? So there you go, that was a little look at Bisbon Village here in Blackpool, to the north of Blackpool. Pretty quiet, like I say, um, I'm filming around about sunset. Uh, so let me know what you think. We didn't run into any beer monsters. It didn't kick off, but we did see an armed response unit though, didn't we? So I'm not going to get loads and loads of views in this video because uh, it's not, it's not exactly action-packed, is it? But I know that this part of town will appeal to quite a few people. I've had a few people say, well, you go up to Bisbon and check Bisbon out. But this is actually Bisbon Village specifically. Yeah, so I know quite a few people will probably know this area and maybe want to see what it's like if they're not living here anymore. So, so anyway, that was Bisbon Village for you. If you like the video, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one.